so we're just hanging out in the Traveler, like in a big hammock, swinging around. But we're waiting to get set down to where we can actually put up our mast. I do have to do some mast work. I gotta run new wire, I gotta put the spreaders back on, the spreaders that I had to fix, and um, do a little tweaking here and there. I'm debating on what to do with the standing rigging. I was thinking about replacing the wire rope that's there. I'm not sure if I want to go with synthetic or want to stay with the wire rope. It's in pretty decent condition. I don't know how old it is, but while it's down, might as well. Looks like the previous owner did a little bit of work to the standing rigging. Uh, he replaced some of the wedge locks with stay locks. So I think I'm just gonna finish the job. And there are a few kinks in the actual wire rope. So I'm probably gonna replace those as well before we get the mast up. So I got all my hardware in for the rigging. It's like Christmas today. Brand new. All right, now we just gotta install it. I was only able to buy a certain size pin for these guys, for the forks, for the stay locks. And unfortunately, it doesn't fit. So I'm gonna have to make some modifications. I had to grab a few files. It's like a glove. Now that the wire is all laid out, I gotta unravel this beast. So I'm the errand girl today, doing a couple errands, and right now I'm at UPS because we ordered some more stay locks. I guess when Bo first ordered them, we didn't get all of them or they weren't the right kind, so it stalled us from finishing up the mast. So Bo's actually at the boat right now working on it, but I'm going to pick these up and then it's almost like the last two puzzle pieces of getting this mast finally up. <laughs> Haven, Massachusetts. Day two of the rigging begins. Una. Una. Can you go find Daddy? Um, making some modifications to the top of the mast. So I gotta cut here and there. Take, take that out. Today is a good day to finish the mast. We've got it rigged and now we have to put some electrical wiring 
and get the spreaders on and then hopefully we'll be able to call someone in the next couple days to get it put up. We are replacing the wires. While we have it down, we decided to go ahead and replace it with new wire. This is insulated and this isn't. So, ah. what's that for? Why is there packing peanuts in here? It's to keep the wires from slapping. <laughs> so we are gonna actually take the new wire and just tape it to the old wire and then pull it through. Of course we tape up the one that isn't the right one. So we're trying to search to find out which cable goes where. We are having the biggest, hardest time trying to find out what this wire is attached to. This wire and this wire are both coming out of the top, but we can't figure out why is it not just coming out. And we can't find a place where it would be attached to. So we have a couple of these cables right here that we cannot get through. So I've required a little bit and ran it through this hole down here and use a use a use some wire as a hook and pulled it through. So we're gonna use the coaxial cable to run it all the way down and then back through again. Because where are the cords? It didn't pull Dang it! All right, let's try this a second time. There she is. With the cable. Victory! <laughs> Bo is doing some more work on the mask. Surprise! So I'm gonna go ahead and cook some lunch up. When we moved on board, we didn't have a gimbaled stove. So we went out and cut one of those just little bitty uh, charcoal grills. And we cooked on that for at least two months. And then we broke down and got an induction stove, which has been so amazing. But I know that we're gonna have to end up getting a gimbal stove eventually but since we've been on the hard we've been using this thing here and that's it we just turn it on it heats up so quick now we caught some really awesome amazing frozen salmon <laughs> i'm gonna make a i don't know kind of a taco-y ish cilantro onions avocados a little lime i found some of this chipotle sauce Sounded pretty yummy. We have some green chilies. So I'm gonna squeeze some lime on top of the salmon and then I'm gonna cook it and I'm gonna throw it on top of some spinach. That'll be our lunch. All done. Now let's go deliver. installing the lights today anchor light got to figure out how to get this guy mounted because it's currently at the top of the mast we just got a pipe and this isn't really gonna fit on that pipe so got to do some more modifications
finally installing these. Thanks for watching. Be sure to tune in next week as we finally get the mass raised. And if you like this episode, be sure to like and subscribe. We super appreciate it. And if you want more, tune in over on Patreon. Thanks, guys. See you next week.